when we say derivative here, we mean directional derivative of this function at this point in this direction. Okay, so nothing super special about this example. Again, we use the dot product. So doof is just the dot product of these two vectors. Of course, dot product makes sense when we have sort of vectors in three dimensions, no problem. So let's compute the components. Firstly, is this a unit vector? Is it? No, it's not. Okay. So So let's compute it. So you square the components and add them and um, square root and then divide. Now according to my calculations you should get um, 1 on root 49 here. So it's just the following. Now <laughs> Come exam time, I'm always staggered at how many people can't do that bit. You can do it! You can do it! Okay? I get upset, depressed when people can't do that. Anyway, let's calculate the, the gradient, grad F. So it's just partials. So we're going to get 3x squared minus y squared minus 2xy and minus 1. Um, so the gradient vector at our point of interest, just sub in. What are we going to get? We're going to get something like 3 minus 1. minus 2 and minus 1. Okay, so let's use this and dotted with Okay, so just a dot product. I'm just going to bring the 1 7th out the front. So we get 4 plus 6 minus 6. 4 sevenths. 